Hello guys and welcome again to our latest tutorial for Microtech configuration and uh, for this time we were gonna talk about how to uh, limit the upload and the download for each client for example I want my client to be an upload of for each of my client an upload of 1 Mbps I have for example I have 10 clients and I have a, a, an upload speed of, for example, 10 Mbps only on upload and 20 or 30 Mbps on download, for example. And so I have 10 clients, so I will divide that one so that they will share an equal amount for upload for a 1 Mbps upload for each client and a 3 Mbps download for each client. So let's go to the default uh, the, by the way this this win box or this microtech i am using the hex series of microtech router board so it is modeled i what is the model i forgot uh, i i think it's 750 gr3 b70 gr3 that is the model of the current uh, microtech router device so uh, this is a default microtech i just put a password here so let's try to connect and uh, again this is a default ip local ip for the uh, microtech router board so before we start i would like uh, to introduce to you what is my local address so we will just type ip config so if we will try don't mind this one because this is a virtual box instance so this is only the local area connection this is my current uh, ip b4 address is 192.168.88.254 because i uh, uh the microtech has a dhp server a range of uh, uh 10 to 254 and the subness subnet mask as usual 255.255.255.0 and the default uh, gateway is the microtech local ip address so moving on and again uh, the local ip of this computer is set to obtain automatically so that i will not set each uh, of the client network address so let's jump on to the tutorial so what we need to do I, I i before again again sorry i i i just want you to understand what is the currently configuration but yet if you are not familiar with the default configuration these are the default de configuration so this are, is my local ip for this uh, microtech board and this a uh, net mask and a dhp server of 10 to 254 so basically from the previous tutorial i did say that this dhp server uh, is uh, crucial to uh, client connection because the dhp server of the microtech router board is the one that assigning to an ip to each of the client for example all of this ip for example you have uh, 244 computers connected to this router through switch router and then another computer has been added uh, that new computer cannot be connected unless one computer uh, has been disconnected so moving on hopefully hopefully that helps so what you need to do is this the important uh, or the main tab that you will be focusing on is the quiz so let's click that one so we need to execute here command that we need to uh, a subnet mask of uh, of this router should be limited for uh, download max and an uh, upload max but before we do that we need to create qui types qui types is basically limiting an inbound or outbound or here on the de destination ip address or source ip address the source ip address is the client that is trying to communicate with the server outside into the internet which is that 
that is what we call the destination IP address. So we call this, we will create a new query type for upload. So we will call this as 3MB. We For example, we need a uh, 1MB or uh, we neglect the, the first example. I, I want an equal upload and download. For example, I want an, a 3MB, I will name this a 3MB upload. So, and then let's choose PCQ. And the rate is, take note of this one. This is bits per second. So, if we try, uh, we will, uh, 3MB, if we try 3000, it is only kilobytes. Kilobits, sorry. And then we add another T, uh, another 30 to make it megabytes. So, this first one is bits. This second one, 30, is for kilobytes and because of it's equal to 3 megabytes. So leave all the ports. Because this is an upload, this is a destination address because we are trying to go outbound the router. So we are trying to uh, connect to a uh, outside address. So I think just leave other to default and we click this on apply click ok and we created for an upload and condition for upload and the next thing is to create a 3mb for download and again we will try to uh, we should uh, choose pcq currently i don't know the meaning of pcq but it's the based on the forum or the wiki of the microtech it should be the kind of a query to limit the uh the limit the uh, traffic so again we will try to write 3 million to have a 3 mb because this is bits uh instead of destination address because this is a download this is an inbound so we we will change this to source address not a destination address so we can also set this the same but i uh, for making it organized i separate upload and download so leave all of that to default and 3m so okay so be before we before we start <coughs> sorry before we start we will try to speed speed test our connection so that you have an evidence that there is a limit on the connection so this is my original connection a ping of 2 and a download of i think it's uh, 50 an average of 50 and an upload of average an average of 90 something like that or sometimes it it is 100 let's just uh wait for the result for me to show you that there is an improvement for the connection so and it's finished so this is these are the result so we minimized it this one take note of that one and the last thing is to create a uh, simple queues simple queues is basically a part where you will be executing the query type that uh, query types that you create previously created so we try to click on plus to add I will just name this as uh, 3MB for example 3MB connection uh, I think uh, 3U for 3 upload to 3D for download so I think that's a, a very informative name and here on target uh, take note of this one uh, uh, if you click on quick set uh, as you can see here this is this is the local IP of my microtype router board so with that being said you can just grab the IP address and to make it a subnet mask just replace the one the last uh, digit or the last uh, group of numbers to zero and forward slash and the uh, masking which is 24 should be 24 
what this basically do all of that line uh, connected from this uh, what this basically means all of the clients that is connected from this uh, microtech router board which is said from this DHP server which is 10 to 254 basically uh, a maximum of 244 uh, clients computer so all of the client co connected will be executed this queue simple queue so the last thing you need to do i think i know this is not the last thing just make it all of this default and go to advance just instead of uh, qui type for upload and qui type for download which is default small we will try to replace it with the previously created uh, qui types for upload the 3 mb upload and for download the 3 mb download so checking double checking all of it is correct target is correct statistics this is for only for data show priority total or just a small for the total uh, we click on apply so here you can see that uh, the current upload max limit is unlimited yet it is affected by the key types that we uh, that we uh, put into this item or entry so we will try to go back let's check if the current connection has been adjusted so let's try to run the speed test what is that oh did we do something wrong Yeah, sorry. I think the the windbox uh, loaded for some time, and if we try to click on the statistics, current speed seven Mbps, and we go back, uh, the download is currently two point ninety four, which we set it to be a two point ninety four per download and per upload and uh, two point ninety four also because we set it to be three upload and three download and I think that is basically it. Uh, the tutorial is very simple and I I hope you like it and unlike other tutorials that don't have a voiceover or it's not a la english language hopefully you make this you found this tutorial very helpful and if you have time hopefully you could uh visit my website and to support me and please before leaving if you if you can please subscribe to my channel i really need your support support and please also like the video if you like it and that's it guys thank you for watching and see you soon for more microtech tutorial